makes sharing a lot easier with AirDrop for macOS and iOS 8. Have you ever had a website or a photo or document you'd like to share with somebody that's right next to you but you don't want to message it or email it? If you're running iOS 8 and Yosemite, you can do a very easy way to share things, and it's AirDrop. So to do that, we'll be here on the iPhone. I'll just open up Safari, and if you want to share this website with uh, the person next to you who's running Yosemite, just tap on the share button, look up there where it says AirDrop. Once AirDrop shows up, just go ahead and tap on who you want to share it with. And then over on the computer, you can see it popped up for me, and now I have the website there in front of me directly from the other device. Very easy. Similar if I want to do something like share a photo. You see I have a photo. Tap on share. Wait for AirDrop to find who I want to share it with. Tap it. Then on the computer, over here you can see it downloaded it for me. And now I have it right there in my downloads folder. And it works vice versa as well. So I can go up to right here within Safari on my computer. There's a similar share button. Click on that. Click AirDrop. It finds me. On my phone, as you see over here, just like that. Shared the website very easily, very quickly. It also works with various things like documents, files, just about anything. You can AirDrop from one Mac device to another iOS device. You just have to be up to date and current. As you see right here, if I go into my control center, I have AirDrop turned on to share with everyone. I can turn it off or make it for contacts only so I can really control who sends me what. That should make sharing a lot easier without having to email, text, or instant message.